Wait, can you guys hear me now? I, okay, yeah, I was still muted on there. Let me say hi again to everybody. My bad. Ben, welcome to you. Dustin, welcome in ILC. Good to see you here. Jamie, Turtle Boy, welcome, welcome. You guys are doing good. And I saw somewhere Jamie can't find a Puma on Classic. That's essentially, in short, what I just said. But I think you can hear me now. Can you hear me now? Okay, perfect, 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 perfect. That's awesome here. We are on Finland, ladies and gentlemen. I've done a little bit of exploring. Uh, if you've seen the video, we've kind of gone through this area. Did some some looking around up here this morning and oh boy. We've got some things to look on. There, this map is a delight. And I mean an absolute delight for a white tiller. I'll, I'll make a white tiller drink time and I'll show you guys. We'll, we'll hunt basically everything we find on the way. But I just got to show you guys this. This is just incredible. Like, it is absolutely freaking incredible. Delilah, welcome in. How are you doing? Let me just make sure I have everything I need. We have tents, some collars. Um, ammo, that's what I need. Bird shot. There we go. Put that in there. And I know I only have one shot of the... Two to three ammo. I'm curious if I have a better two to three shot anywhere. I don't think I do. Yeah, no, don't look like it. Let's look if I can buy any. I don't know. Oh, I can actually. Yes. Okay. Let's go. Ten more, and then I am officially broke. Ah, uh, I am um, officially, officially broke in this game. We have eighty-five dollars to our name. Oh wow. Let's go. Now let's look. What spot am I going to show you guys first? Because there are some incredible spots on here. Um, oh, where do I start off? Where do I... Actually, before we do anything, let me guys... If you haven't seen the video. Oh, that's a white tail buck. Or a female, apparently. Thought that was a bug. But yeah, as you can see by the only pressure, there are oh, there are some good spots here. But yeah, let me show you guys the, the starting lodge first. Which I do believe is this one right over here. Let me just make sure. I know I'm I'm crazy rich in this game, you know. I don't think don't think you can go any higher than that, can you? We're definitely definitely millionaires on here. A hundred percent. Ah. Alright, let's let me show you guys this because this is really really cool. First of all, you spawn in like this uh, little village area where your house is one of the small ones here on the side. I actually haven't tried if you can go in the other ones. I know we should be able to get in there. Alright, I guess we can't. But yeah, this is... I want to show you guys the view in a second. But apparently there's something you can do with the cars. Apparently you can open the doors. Oh, look at that. You can open the doors of the cars. I think Papa Grizzly was the one that talked about this in chat. Either way, I just thought that was quite funny that you could do that. But without further ado, I mean, look at this. Look at how open some of these areas are. It is just freaking incredible. It is absolutely stunning. I, I, I was so blown away by this when I got on here yesterday. It was incredible. And then it is now clearly marked on the map where you can travel across where the, these lines are. You have to discover some of them first, I believe, before you see it. But, you know, oh, such a improvement, such a quality of life improvement. That is just freaking amazing. And there's some other things you'll see as well later on. The more we play, I just look freaking incredible on here. Like, it is done so so good and from what i've seen so far i think this is going to be a great map for white tail hunting like really really good but yeah let's let's interact with this boat let's go across um right i'm passing through pennsylvania right now connection is not the best but i might miss um some stuff in chat no worries ben you will have a good and safe travels if you can make it in or not it is good either way i understand it completely just uh, be safe on the road. 
Uh, I stay at 200k in game, I'll spend, then within a few mountain goat runs, I'll get back at 200k and 300k. I've been, I've been spending a lot of cash recently to get tents. Like, I'm carrying four tents right now. We have a couple of tripod stands. I pulled a few from Mississippi. Uh, not Mississippi, from Rancho, just because uh, I won't be using them on there. Um, and since we're setting up the, the white tilder grind on here anyways, I thought I might as well do that. And, you know, set it up all on here, since I think this is going to be the map to do it on. Um... Your arm's doing better? That's good to hear. That is good to hear. Happy to hear that. Um... Yeah, Jamie, I wish I could help you with that Puma, man. I really wish I do, but... I know that this is gonna suck for you to hear, but I think they drink in similar areas to where... Where they're on Timbergold Trail, and I believe they're on the same side where the Bighorn Sheep are as well. So, not the best of news for you. Uh, to be honest, this map looks so much more beautiful than the others. Um, to be fair, a lot of the maps got a... Um, because of the new reflections, like you can see it even if I pull out the guns. You see a little bit of that, that new like shadowing and just reflections thing that's in the game. Uh, we can go on another map later and I can show you guys. They have added some vibrancy to the maps. The whole new way that things are rendered in just looks freaking amazing. Like, some of these changes just make the game look... It, it pops a lot more. Like, it truly, truly does. And it's just such a new experience. Forktail, welcome in. How are you doing? TA, welcome to you as well. Like, some of this stuff just freaking has been done really, really well. It is incredible, to say the least. But yeah, I'm trying to find some... I want to show you guys what some of these white tail zones look like. And maybe I should have gone in an area where I actually know where they are. Did you get the pop reset? Um, I haven't really spent any time on the other maps yet. Uh, except for just quickly looking what time um, some things drink. But I do believe that there was a pop reset down on every single map except for Silver Ridge Peaks. Alright, okay, the white tilde are on the other side, not this side. We'll see some soon though, don't worry. Like this map again is... You walk through here and you'll find stuff everywhere. Like, you truly, truly will. There's a lot of just birds laying in between, going around, that kind of stuff. Oh look, there's... Oh no wait, that's... Oh, Rock Farm again. Let's, let's go investigate. We'll probably only see them flying away, but we might as well have a look. Look, there it is. Oh, where did it go? Alright, there was something just flying away there. Might have missed it a little bit. But there was something just there. Yeah, this is what I mean. Like, there's just stuff kind of walking around here. And apparently the north right corner of the map is just incredible for moose so we might check that out later as well um when they drink but all in due time we'll take this step by step i don't want to rush through everything too too quickly but yeah let me quickly go here and check at that lake um you get to keep any trophy you get i think right I'm not sure how it works this time, because technically we're on a dev build. Well, dev build. Um, we're not on like a final release yet, so there might still be some quirks here and there. But I do think that we can transfer this save file over back to the live game in the end. And oh look, Farmageddon back already. Where are you at? I've got a shotgun with me, I'll shoot you. Oh wait, there it is. I know this is the complete wrong weapon. Ah, okay, we're not gonna get that one, and I'm not gonna waste the bullets I have for here. Moose on the loose. Oh, Jamie, there are so many moose on the loose here. I think uh, once you see this, I think you're gonna get a little bit crazy. To be real, to be 
To be honest with you, I think you're gonna go a little bit crazy. Um, do you not like that there's a new map with Brown Bear? Oh, I love it. I think it's really cool. Uh, if you saw the video, Brown Bear look fantastic now. They look gorgeous. If we see one, we will shoot it. I don't care. Unless, of course, we have like a, a legendary or something in front of us. Then, uh, then we'll shoot that first and then come back for the Brown Bear. But let me tell you, oh my, the harvest screen and the animals... They've done some rework there. I don't know if it's just because of the reflections. Or if they generally did something. Um, with the textures. But things look so much crisper. And more contrast. It just overall looks really, really well done. Like, it is incredibly awesome. And yeah, again, look. We have a another boat here. Which is, I assume, going to take us right on over there. Um, yesterday I found a 98 scoring gold albino mountain goat. Is that rare? Yes, that is rare. Albino mountain goats are definitely not the most common thing in the world. Yeah, I don't think we're in white tilt territory here anymore. So let's go to the point where I actually saw a good amount of them. Come on, tent. Alright, I've had this a couple times. Where are my... Ten. There we go. This is more a thing of my mouse. There we go. Okay. Worked that time. Let me show you guys some things. Um, thought it was changed. The AR release had them playing in the same thing we would play in. All the CCs got to keep their trophies. I think that was mainly because it wasn't a new map, to be fair. Uh, I didn't do that because, well, I wasn't playing at the time. Because I was uh, overall at college. But um, I am currently playing on my save, so we have our trophies in there. Just that I had to transfer it over to the um, to the dev build, which is what the difference is there. Um, he seemed brighter white than usual, but it was what well, was surprised to say it was an albino. Yeah, they are hard to spot uh, to the fact that there are albino, but it is definitely not something common. And where did that? Okay, I guess we're not going to see where that came from. Ooh, did I place my tent far enough away? Is this seriously not going to show up? Oh, it was probably... Okay, one thing you will notice. Geese here will actually... Um, throw out calls while in the air. And look at how many we have there ready. You know what? We could actually try and call them in. If this would let me do it again. Oh, my freaking mouse. Oh, my God. Right, let me place down a marker. I think this tent might be a little bit too close. Right, let's just walk back up there. And then we can call in some of these uh, Chandra Bean Goose up here in the sky. And I don't know if these guys only go up to level 3 because I think their diamond for them is actually um, 3 point something, I believe. But you know what? Let's call these guys in. I've noticed that you can kind of call them in even if you don't have a call, if you don't even have a setup. Um, I did manage to call in a group of them earlier just by doing this. And it seemed to work quite good, but you know. Let's kind of see. I kind of want to try and get that three down. And we have some coming in close already, apparently. Let's uh, lay down. Let's get that collar going. Are they already on the ground? I hear some flapping very close to us. But let's just throw out some calls here. Um, Brown bear are one of my favorite favorite uh, animals but I can't hunt them on medved so brown bear alone is the reason for me to get this map awesome Dustin that's great to hear you know the title says multiplayer hopping for trophies right wait what what happened with that what is this let me edit that real quick uh, why was that not changed 
One second. That's my bad. Or well, YouTube's bad, I guess, because I changed it. Um, we'll get right back to those goose. My bad. Uh, is the thumbnail at least correct? Does that say early access or not? Nina, welcome to you as well. How are you doing? I'm curious. Did we manage to call in any of them? And look, there you go. You can kind of see that icon up there in the sky. But yeah, I'm curious now if we have some some geese in here. Do you know where the Capricali are? So the area that I'm in right now, there's actually quite a few Capricalis around here. Capricalis, however you want to pronounce them around here. But they seem to be a little bit like in this area here. I've seen quite a few. I think there's even some zones around here. Um, That's Hazel Grouse. Rock Farm again. I know I've seen them around here. So they definitely do pop up around. And look, there is just more... More of these guys. Like, there is a lot of ducks here, and we're going to call them, or geese as well. well. We'll call them in as well. Um, I don't usually don't like the flying species like pheasants and Canadian geese, but this map adds a lot of good ones. I like the hazel grouse and the tufted ducks. I've actually not seen the tufted ducks yet, I believe. I don't think I've come across them. But I do believe they're more of a southern species, and I haven't been in the south too, too much. So I think what we might do a little bit later today is actually go out down in the south and see if we can find anything there. But yeah, let me get in here now and get in my little setup. Oh, there was geese there. All right, let's try and get some. Uh-oh. Let me tell you one thing. They are definitely a lot harder to hit. <laughs> that's, that's one thing I've noticed. It, it's not quite as easy as it used to be. It is still manageable. But it's not as easy as it used to be. But let's call again. Let's see if some of them will come in. Because this is quite a popular area I found. <laughs> I need a piebald big rank rate one before Finland release. That is gonna be tough, little boy. That is gonna be very, very, very tough. That's not gonna be easy. You like Melda's better, actually? Of uh, the mountain goat, I assume that's what you're talking about. They are very cool, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, they definitely stand out more than the albinos. But having either one is, is pretty cool. I think they're probably about the same rarity, at least nowadays. My dad had shoulder, uh, shoulder surgery today. Luckily, everything went well without any complication. He's doing good now. That's great to hear, Nina. That is awesome to hear. I hope he has a quick and speedy recovery. And look at that. Already got some white tail back there as well. And you can just see basically all of the zones are roughly as open as that. Some of them are a little bit more hidden, but generally speaking, this is kind of as open as it gets. And of course, now that we're here at the blind, freaking <laughs> freaking things don't want to come in. That's no good. Um, and then I actually like pheasants and Canadian geese, but those are the only ones. Ah, okay, my bad. Might have read that wrong then. Ooh, more white-tailed here. Where are you guys coming from? Guess you guys are coming in for a late zone. But we have more geese. Ooh, they're flying away. They are flying away. I thought they're coming in. But yeah, let's let's hit some more callers. If we don't get anything in a second, we'll move on. We'll hunt those those white tail deer. Ooh, there's some coming in back there. All right, let's have a look. Any other there you guys can hear? Mating call from them. Very, very nice. 
I, I don't know. I haven't quite figured out the how they break yet. But, you know. Let's throw out some calls. And I don't know if they split up if that means that all of them are breaking. Or if only that two or only those threes are breaking. Because it looks like they're all wanting to come in. And I shall not complain about that. Look at that. White Tiller coming right up here. So I'll definitely get a picture of that. I mean, that guy is quite a nice one, to be fair. But yeah, let's, uh, let's hit some more calls. Because these geese are starting to come close. Alright, come on. I just want to show you guys off. Alright, let's definitely try and get that three out there. He has no dime potential, but you know. Might as well get the biggest one that's going on there. Um, or at least another diamond or super rare. Imagine a super great one pops up on the first day of Finland. That'd be insane. I'm pretty sure somebody's going to have an initial spawn great one somewhere. Like, that's almost guaranteed. And what was that? That could not have been a white tiller, could it? Right, that might have been that white tiller, to be fair, but... Alright, let's do some more calling. Oh, they're coming in. They are coming in hot. Alright, let's look. Where's that three? There he is. Alright, they've kind of landed a little bit uh, badly for me to shoot. You know what? Oh look, there's Capra Kelly right back there. Alright, we just completely messed up <laughs> uh, those geese, but... Oh wait, are they gonna come flying back this direction? Might as well get the shotgun ready. But yeah, I think I might have to uh, work on the placement of this thing over here. Because that was um, not so great. But yeah, let's, uh, we'll get back to them. We will definitely get back to them. But I wanted to show you guys some of the amazing freaking white shell spots. Because there are some good ones. And some really, really good ones at that as well. So let's get there. Been playing Jurassic World Evolution 2. Pretty good game. But I don't have to grind like I thought to unlock dinosaurs for sandbox. Seeing as they're already available. That is good to hear man. That is good to hear. And while we're here I might as well. Take out that guy. Just because we definitely need the cash. <laughs> Sitting at 85 bucks right now. We will shoot anything and everything that we can. Because we are desperate for cash, and I do mean desperate. Alright, where's that big boy that we saw? Oh, there he is. Hiding back there. There are, I also have seen already a couple of dime potentials, which I want to try and smoke on stream today. Because they did look very, very promising. I didn't 100% memorize where they were, but I do have a rough idea of where they were. So we'll just go to some of the lakes I've visited already and just try and shoot the big guys. But yeah, let's... Oh, I thought we could still get him. Um, That's like if he slows down, I might try and take a shot at him. Come on. I seriously just missed a shot at a stopping deer. That's not good. That is not good. Alright, I think that should take him down. Uh, I guess we'll see in just a second. Alaskan! Welcome, welcome. How are you doing? Good to see you here. Um, I haven't really got to see what the bean goose or new rabbit species yet. I haven't shot a single one of the... You rabbit species, but look, here we go. Can you see the difference? 
on how this looks. Like, does this not look freaking amazing? Like the new harvest screen images. I, I, I find this just looks freaking crazy, incredible. Like personally, I think that looks really, really, really good. Like, I feel like that looks so, so good. Uh, lungs and voices said it not to work, so I get to be here. Ooh. Uh, I assume that means you're sick, Alaskan. That is a no good. No good to hear at all. That is so beautiful. Right, right, turtle? Like, that, is, that just looks gorgeous. Like, that absolutely freaking looks gorgeous. Like, incredible. Wait, wait and see until we get to a brown bear. Because the brown bears just look, whoa. Oh, so good. Like, they truly look incredible. Also, I've just noticed this. I don't know why there's a black bar at the bottom of the call the wild screen. I've got no clue, but... Yeah, apparently we currently have a black bar there at the bottom. Don't know why, but again, look at this. Like, that is just so incredible to see. That's just so awesome. And I'm so, so happy about that. Can't wait. I can't wait either. Um, how do you feel about the removing some animal drink zones? I hate it because everything drinks sometimes. Um, so actually, one thing about that, um, links on here do have a drink zone. Um, they drink from, I believe it's 3 to 6 a.m. Um, let me check where their drink zone was. Yeah, there it was just there. I'll check in just a second what it is. Uh, found any good brown bear lakes? I haven't actually gone in their drink zone yet, but yeah, look. Doesn't this look freaking gorgeous? Like, I find that that looks freaking amazing. Give me one second. I gotta quickly uh, turn my fan around because it is getting hot in here. Alright, there we go. There we freaking go. Okay. By a look, Lynx drink in the morning from 3 to 6. I haven't found out when brown bear drink, but I do believe it's from 8 till 12 in the evening but yeah we'll, we'll 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 go there in time we'll go check it out for now though let's go down here because i believe this is one of the spots where we have the good um one of the good white deers. um i wish they put where i can buy one mil for <laughs> yeah i don't know that kind of takes away the whole grinding of the game I don't know. I feel like that wouldn't wouldn't do too much. That kind of make it a, a pay to win game in that sense, if you know what I mean. Any moose information? Yes. Yeah, so moose drink from uh. Whoa! What was it? Um. When do moose drink again? Let me check. Um, I believe it's from twelve thirty to four thirty, or it's from fourteen thirty till eighteen thirty. Is uh, one of the two. Have you found any Eurasian links? Yeah, I've seen a couple of the links already. Um, they look really good as well. Let me um, show you guys in a second. Let's look. I think there's a, a link zone. At, oh, look. There's one right there. Isn't that a links? Where was he? Pretty sure I just saw one roaming around there. Oh, look. Right there. There is a five medium right over there. I feel like we should try and get him. Let's see if he turns. Off the bat. Oh yeah, I saw that, Delilah. I saw that. We probably have a diamond looking around somewhere as well. But, you know, I haven't hunted everything yet, so. Ooh, what's that? Some Capricalis. Let's look if we can spot them from back here. Yeah, look, there's one right there. There's another one right over there. And there you go. There they go flying. Off into the sky. Alright, let's look if that lynx is going to go down. I feel like he should. Okay, he is going down. 
Um. I also don't know why I took. Oh, I, I remember why I took the two, two, three. It was the lighter gun of them all. Um. But it would be pay to win. Exactly. It it, it would be pay to win, and I don't know. I just think that takes away so much of the game. Like, part of the fun is trying to get all the cash together to be able to buy your tents, your tripod stands, all of that good stuff. I feel like if they took that away, then everybody would just have completely set up maps. Damn, can that freaking Lynx just boggle on down? Alright, come on now. Oh, freaking Lynx, come on. Come on, man. Go down. Oh, there we go. There he fell. Now, I know that I have a white hose on somewhere around here, I believe. Not 100% sure where it was or if we maybe just spooked it away. But yeah, no, it should be back there. But I don't know if we maybe spooked them away. There's another Lynx there, male as well. I think we should maybe quickly investigate to see if it's anything worth shooting. After all the times I restarted, I found that you have two or three diamonds already on your map. Yeah, that is true. That is true. You generally have like a rare or two and then like a couple diamonds on your map somewhere. Um, but it's random. Sometimes you have one, sometimes you have four. Sometimes you have like three rares and one diamond. Sometimes you have zero rares, but then a diamond more or something. Oh, max weight Lynx. Should we go chase that? I feel like we should go chase that. Let me just make sure quickly that he's not roaming off to the side somewhere there. And then let me make sure that he's not actually running off in the other direction. Yeah, no, okay, he is going over there. I think we should go track him. See what we have. See what kind of cool trophies we have around here. Uh, you get around two to four diamonds or rares on a new map, sometimes up to five. That is true. Um, How would be nice for 100k for rewards after, like, a holiday update? Yeah, I, I would not have anything against having, like, a, a reward thing where, like, you can... Get yourself some extra cash if you wanted to by doing like a, a special type of mission. And look, there is more white tilder there. But you know, like it's it's a balancing thing. You don't want it to be too too overpowered. But yeah, look at that. Does that not look freaking stunning? Like that just looks so good in my opinion. Like, so, so good. Like, I think that just looks freaking phenomenal. In my mind, of course. Some people might say it looks like it's too much contrast on there. But I think that looks sick. Like, really, really sick. Like, that just... It's just so, so cool. Like, wait until you see the brown bears. The brown bears so far... In comparison to how they were before, such a big change. Such a big change and such a good change as well. Definitely, definitely for the better. No, wait, was that it just on there? Or what did I get the spot? All right, I don't know, but we have the feed zone at least. But let's, let's go track this thing because that is a max weight potential. I think that down there is... Where did it run off to? That's what I got to figure out. Do they change the links? It looks better. Um, I didn't like the links, but I like the model. I think I think it's just the way they changed it in terms of... Um, what should I call it? I think they changed kind of what the animals look like in general. Uh, in terms of the new shaders and all that kind of stuff. 
DK, welcome, welcome. How are you doing? You think the moose is the new great one? It might be. It might very, very well be. That could be a real possibility there. I have no clue. They have not told us a thing about what the new great one is. So, I think once the new update drops on Tuesday, the 28th, I think that's when we'll truly find out what this is when we... Um, what the great one is because that's when people are going to start grinding all of the animals Whereas now it's kind of a a smaller sample size, you know Like right now, it's what like 20 of us playing this map So that's obviously nothing compared to the thousands that are gonna play um, Once this release happens and how many people are gonna be grinding the different animals I think I, I reckon I'll give it like a like four or five days before somebody figures out what it is. I think by the weekend we'll know. Well, let's call it that. I think by next weekend we'll probably have a confirmation on what the new great one is. That's just what I think. It could very well much be a lot quicker. Because somebody gets one off of initial spawns. Or it could just take like two or three weeks. Who knows? We have no idea. Um, have I gotten a diamond yet? Flinder got a diamond. Whitetail? No, I have not gotten a diamond yet. But we have a couple of potentials um, roaming around, which we're going to be having to find um, soon. It's actually what I wanted to do, but we found this max weight Lynx track. And I kind of wanted to go track with that. And yeah, look, that is an 8 mythical. Let's go shoot that. Just so that we don't have that track anymore. And then let's move on to Whitetail again. I think we should have quite a good view from here. Um, Alright, I think that should be good. Um, no? Alright, where did this guy run off to? You know what? We can always shoot him later. We can always shoot him later. Let's go... Where do I want to go first? Oh, actually, you know what? Let's go here. Because this right here is an amazing spot. Uh, they said you can get the name from the Discord they have with the chats in it. Wait, what, Delilah? Uh, explain what you mean with that. Probably news because they did all those polls and it dominated until elk. I mean, who knows? It might be, it might not be. We'll kind of just have to wait and see, but look at that. Look at that. That is just one of the groups of white children that's here. Let me look. Do I have any hunting pressure? I have a little bit left, but that's one of the potentials we have. It's one of the smaller ones, but he does look very, very promising. Let me say that much, at least. Alright, let's... I'm a, no, we still have an hour of drink time, okay. Let's um, try and get him down. All right, he's just circling around. I want to get him, him. Yeah, I want to get those two. And then back there is already the next zone. So yeah, let's go right around here. Let's pull out this. Oh, okay, cool. That is both of those guys down. Perfect. Very nice. And then there's another zone right over there. But as you can see, there is just some of the easiest whitetail hunting you can do. Look, there's another zone right back there. Don't quite know where the bucks are right now, but I feel like if you get like a, a tripod stand or maybe even a tree stand up somewhere like there, this might be an incredible set. Uh, the chats on Discord have the name of the great one in. Huh. So, has anybody figured out then what those names are? Or has it just been posted like randomly and we're supposed to figure out by the name um, what it is? And yeah, look at this. Oh, freaking incredible. Like these white tail are just... I love the way 
these new harvest screens look. Like, personally, I think they did a great freaking job with it. Like, if they would just move this down a little bit more so that we could capture the whole animal in, like, a picture. Uh, that's the only thing that I, I wish they had done at some point. Like, well, that's, like, really the only thing. Everything else is just phenomenal. All right, let's go to this lake up here. And then I think I want to put a tripod or tent up there. So I think we might go ahead and do that quickly. Um, you don't know yet if somebody did? Oh, okay. Interesting to know. Or, I mean, good thing to know and interesting. We'll see. All right, let's look. Where... Actually, you know what? Before we do that, let's go... Take a quick peek over here at these lakes as well. Because, yeah, this again right here, I feel like this might be a really good spot for for geese hunting. Because look at how open this is. This is freaking incredible how open it is. Like, if geese fly here, which I haven't really tested out, I've only walked by here once. Um, but we'll kind of have to see also what time they're more active at. But once we figure that out, I feel like having a setup somewhere around here might be... A very good thing and something that will be very profitable but then again also look at how open these lakes are like this is where white shell drink right we thought rancho was open to hunt white tail deer look at this like this is just so freaking open like, it's a piece of pie to spot a white tail deer around here. Like, it truly, truly is. And yeah, we'll kill that guy in a second. Don't you worry. I just wanted to have a quick look over here to see if there was anything else running around. But yeah, let's go. Let's shoot that male right over there before he runs away. Come on. Turn again, big boy. Um, I haven't seen dark brown for white tail yet. Is it new? Um, I'm not sure. I think dark brown, um, existed before. At least I'm pretty sure it did. I do not think that that was new. Uh, I'm pretty sure that existed before that. Be back in 10 minutes. Okay, I'll see. No worries. No worries. I shall see you soon. I, what happened with him? I thought we had a good shot. Alright, I guess we'll have to do it like that. I guess we will just have to do it like that then. Boy, I mean, if this is where some geese are going to come around, like I said, I feel like this right here might be an incredible spot for them. Like, really, really good. And look, right as I say that, there's some geese coming in. Now, let's try what I did earlier. I just kind of called them in even without decoys. And it does sometimes work. It, it Where did they go? Um... But I seriously... Oh, were they flying away? They might have been flying away. Oh, you know, they're above us now. Right, these are just Canadian geese, but, you know. I can try calling them in. Let's see if any one of them is going to break. We don't have any decoys here, but, you know. Come on, break one of you. There's another flock off to the right as well. Let's look. There's a couple of them. But they don't seem to be too interested. And 
yeah, I don't think they're interested at all in what I have to say. <laughs> Alright, let's keep running. Wait. There we go. Um, right there is where I would hunt geese and ducks. Or can ducks even come there? I think ducks are more in the south here. Um, we'll go there in a little bit. I haven't really hunted the ducks yet. I haven't seen the golden eye, the tough, the duck, the Eurasian um, teal, I think it's called. I haven't hunted that area yet, so we'll kind of have to wait um, until I try this out more. I mean, I literally just got this map yesterday and most of my time uh, spent was trying to get the video out for today and then trying to unlock the map. Um, I would have done more research uh, if I didn't have work today, but I had to get in at 7.40 this morning and then I, I just got out recently like I literally came home got changed and set up for stream that's that's basically how it went so you know it's not much uh, not much time I had there today at all so basically I had to do everything yesterday and well, this is about as uh, far as I had gotten. So we'll definitely check out that. But look, rock farm again up there again as well. See those little guys right over here? Let's see, maybe I can get one of them with a shotgun. Oh, I hit it. Oh, got two of them. Can I get another one? I don't think we hit one that time. But look at that. Got ourselves a female there. Look at how awesome these look. Like these look really, really cool. Oh, 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 oh. Uh. Ah, these new... These new flying speed things are still something I'm going to have to get used to. It is still quite something different, but at least we got some of them. And look at this. This is one of the molting ones. They need a diamond score of 709. So they do get quite a bit bigger still. Wait, wait. Can I call in these guys? Let's try it out. Let's see. I probably heard my shotgun shots, but if not, let's have a look. We have a four there in the front, which... Right, he doesn't even have that big of a score, to be fair. Kind of want to show you guys what one of these guys look like, though. Alright, okay. We're not going to hit him. <laughs> We are not going to hit him. I tried. I tried. And look, there's just more rock farm again up here as well. Freaking crazy. Freaking, freaking crazy. We'll, we'll hunt. We'll go look around for some of these. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't go, don't go, don't go, don't go. Yes, sir. I almost deleted all the zones here. Okay, gotta control myself. Gotta control myself. But yeah, molting doesn't seem to be rare. But look at these birds. They just look freaking amazing. But yeah, now back to the main plan. Let's go up here. There we go. Come on. Let's go place a tent. Those look amazing. Exactly. I wonder if boats would ever be added into Caldwell since the angler. Didn't think there was a chance until now. I mean, we never know. It might happen. It might happen. I would love to see those jeeps be added to Caldwell though. Like, those jeeps look freaking cool. Like, really, really, really cool. Um... It'll be cool for an angle DLC for Gold Wild, like not fishing, but already mounted fish you can put on the walls in the trophy lodge. Also, bear rugs. 
and just other stuff to personalize lodges. I think that would be cool. But I'm going to be honest with you, I don't think that's going to be coming for a while because I think they're going to be more orientated around um, like gameplay content first, uh, first, you know? Stuff like that. I think that's going to come before them adding stuff like um, Trophy Lodge personalization. But they might come in as like an addition, as like an extra. I don't think it's going to be a like standalone DLC like custom trophy lodge update or whatever i feel like it might be more of like an addition similar to how um what's it called multi mounts get added here and there and then so for people who have the trophy lodge dlc they can get um like customization or stuff like that but i don't think it in in and of itself i don't think it's gonna um, be happening just like that if you kind of get what I mean but yeah, let's place this down right over here and then I think we'll place tripod stands down uh, at a later date because for now I want to see those those lovely lovely white tail deer real quick and then if we have okay we don't quite have decreased tonic pressure here yet because I would have loved to show you guys this lake over there but we might have to go there in a future stream I mean this is not going to be the only time that we are playing this map. We have all weekend to play. And we're going to be back live again tomorrow. Um, and then we won't be live Saturday. Oh look at that. Got a nice moose right over there. But then we'll be again again live Sunday I believe. So you know. We will be playing this more and more. And if you guys want to see one of the other maps. Us going on there checking out what changed. What's new? We can definitely, definitely do that. And ooh, there's another dying potential right on over there. Alright. Let's shoot that guy. I don't think he's going to make it, but you know. We might as well try and take the shot and... Okay, I was about to say, if we didn't get a vital lung... Oh, look at that zone. I actually didn't see this one earlier because that's the way I came from. But oh, buddy. I say big boy zone right there. That is a big, 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 big boy zone. I know what. We're going to lay down for that one right over here. Let's also reload real quick. NASCAR! Welcome, welcome, welcome. How are you? Good to see ya. All right. Which two do we want to take out? Oh, I kind of want to get him, but I know I'm not going to get a good shot. So let's get him. Let's get him. And then if one more of them will be a guinea pig, I mean, I'll shoot them. I mean, some of them just don't need to be affected that I just shot in there. I mean, if he's going to turn broadside, I'll take the shot, you know? Definitely not be picky. I just want it to be a male. Right, come on. want to turn sideways. I know it. Come on. Give me a little bit more of a turn. Boom. That's what I wanted to see. Perfect, perfect. It's been too long. It has, NASCAR. It definitely, definitely has been. That really small lake by the place that starts with T, can't spell it lol, is the place Frinter got his diamond whitetail. Um, T. Um, do you mean this lake over here? In Tapion Vori? Is that what you mean? Is this the little lake you mean? What else starts with T? Yeah, that's definitely not it. Um... Because uh, we, we've got to check out more lakes. Like, I've found a lot of whitetail zones. But I know I haven't found them all, you know? Like, we have more roaming around here somewhere. Welcome back. Need to get my lazy bum to make a YouTube video, lol. Yeah. Go do it. I mean, Tuesday is the perfect reason to go ahead and do it again. You know? It really, really is. 
Have I missed anything while I was gone? No, Turtle Boy, you have not. Actually, we, we hunted some of the... Some of the ducks. We, we've hit some... We've shot some of them, but... Didn't get anything crazy there. We've kind of just... Shot, I think, like three or four rock farm again. That was kind of it. Oh, look at that. Moose are starting to drink. Nice. Okay. Time to go looking for some moose. I haven't shot any on here yet. But we might get the 300 out then. To give these, gal a prop give, these, uh, give these guys a proper barrel. Now, where's the other male we shot? Oh, wait. Oh, we, didn't, we just shot one here, didn't we? We didn't take two down here. All right, let's pick up those guys back there. And then I think we'll pull out the 300 and start looking for some moose. Maybe we have a big boy male somewhere. Maybe we have a five just flying around. Or maybe the moose are the great one and we have one off of initial spawns. <coughs> cough, cough. Please call the wild gods. Give me something like that. Alright, okay, those guys up there are already nervous, so they're not going to be coming in. Uh, what's moose drink time? It is um, from 12 to 1600, so it's four hours just like white tail deer. So definitely a very, very long drink time, and I know that they're quite dispersed around the map, which is good. Um, moose got to be the new great one with their map getting reset. I mean, all of the maps are technically getting resets. The only ones that are not getting a reset are um, Silver Ridge Peaks. That is literally the only one that is not going to get a full reset. Everything else is getting reset. No question about it. All right, let's look. I wanted to see one of these lakes for Musa. I wanted to see what's going up up here. And then before we go walk down there... There we go. My tent is a little bit of a pain. I think I placed it a little bit too close. I think I was a little bit too close. Um, okay, let's let's move this tent just a teeny tiny bit. Let's put it back down here. That should be good. Now let's get in here and let's see if we can maybe get some of the geese to come in. Would be nice. Is the moose drink time? Yes, it is. It is the moose drink time now. All right. Let's look if we can call these suckers in. First, we got to wait for some of them, though. Shouldn't be too hard, though, I think. Let's look. I, actually, let me show you guys what all the callers sound like. Um, and by the way, we do have this lovely wheel. So, you've heard the Grey Leg Goose one. Let's go to the Eurasian Widgeon caller. Oh, actually, we'll get that again in a second. Bean Goose are coming in. Let's go. And they seem to be breaking, so... Let's look what we have coming in here. We've got a level 2, a level 2. What else? Another level 2. Wait. And a level 3. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. Let's get him coming in. Let's see if we can get some this time. Unlike last time, that was a little bit embarrassing. Not gonna lie. Wait, wait, is this the right caller? Um, Tundra Bean Goose, yes, that is the right one. This is, by the way, what the Grey Lake Goose caller sounds like. Okay, it's literally the same one. Never mind. I thought it had a little bit of a different sound. Ooh, more of them coming in. Let's look. Another two, another two. Yeah, so three from earlier. Where did the other ones go? Oh, there they are. Sure, if there's a... Okay, never mind. Ooh, more back there as well. 
It's definitely getting popular around here. I hope they come in from like that side there. If they come in through there, they're gonna be golden, but I think some of them already landed. Behind my back. So we'll just kind of shoot whatever we can thought. Um now every single map is getting changed except for SRP. SRP is the only one that didn't make the cut this time. Everything else is uh, getting a full reset. Um, but SRP is still getting it. No, SRP is not in this one. SRP is going to be uh, in the next update from what we've heard so far on stream. Oh, I hear him, I hear him, I hear him, I hear him. Alright, let, let's get one of these guys. Alright, where more, where more, where more? There are some right there. Is there a three in there somewhere? There's another one. Oh, look, they react now. That's awesome. Alright, okay. We got three of them down. I'll take that. I shall take that. Can you check at some point this stream? Uh, what do you want me to check, uh, NASCAR? Um, ooh, look at these guys. Oh, these look freaking amazing. Oh. Look at them. These look freaking awesome. That is cool. That is so, so cool. Jeez. Let's look. Um, I don't have the patch notes, but what I can check real quick is I can check all the maps that are getting a reset because that is the one thing that we were told. So give me a second. Let me quickly pull that up for you. I can read to you out loud everything that they sent us. Um... um at least I think it's on here. Fingers crossed. Should have probably let you guys looking at a bingo, shouldn't I? Alright, let's do this. The FAQ. Um, there we go. Full thing coming out now. Um, where did I see this the other day? Um, 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 um. I thought I saw this somewhere. Was it in this link? Um, I'm pretty sure I saw it somewhere yesterday. I'm gonna be honest. Um, 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 um. All right, I will try and find that. Um, we don't have a full patch notes. Actually, I can check if we got one now. Uh, if you give me one second. Let's look how we got in the patch notes here. Um, no, we don't yet. Okay. But I was pretty sure that those were there. Um... Make me want some more me. <laughs> hey, go for it, Dustin. Go for it. Oh, more geese. Oh, these guys are coming in. All right, let's let's get a redemption shot at. Ooh, that guy's got potential. As if I, 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 I'll see. I won't fall for that one. I will not fall for that one. Ah, oh, there you go. We can stand up again. Where did these guys go? There they are. All right, let's finish uh, spawning around here. I really want to try and get that level 3 male. That's the guy right there I want. But yeah, I digress. Let's very quickly just have a look what else there is. Come on. There's a lot of twos in there, but okay. Let's keep calling and let's try and zero in for that guy. Um, well, the only thing that I can see if I go on Verhanga is 
I still have the same hunting pressure. The only thing that I could do there is... Um... To see if all the zones are gone, which I don't think even all of them would be gone. I feel like some of them would be still there. But we could check and go to the same lake and see if um, zone times or something like that changed. We can do that here in a minute, real quick. Let me get that, that goose right there, though. Because I really, really want to get that. Oh, damn. These guys came in hot. All right, where's my level three at? I swear, if I had a good shotgun right now, these guys would not stand a chance. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. I want a male. Okay, cool. Ah, I wanted to get that level three. All right, we got these two at least. Let's find them. Where did I shoot them? Oh, this is where a retriever dog would be perfect. This is what's always going to happen to me when I hunt geese. Oh, and look, moose are there. On a whole different note. Okay, let's uh, pick up the goose. Oh, uh, snap. Where did we shoot them? <laughs> um, yeah, this is where it might be bad. Um, you need the catch a tour? Yeah, I don't have that unlocked yet. I don't have enough uh, shotgun score yet. I still need more shotgun score for that. Hmm. Where is my geese? Where is the geese? Um, oh, there's one of them. Let's have a look. This at least was one of them flying. Looks very, very nice. Can't complain. They don't pay quite as good as uh, the geese did before, but I mean, they do still pay quite good. Now let's look. Where's the other one that we shot? I believe it was further down here. Uh, bird track goes slower apparently, which is kind of sucks, but whatever. I haven't really noticed it too much. I just find you have to lead a little bit more than you used to in the past. But that's just me. I haven't done geese hunting in a while, so I might just be a little bit inexperienced. And maybe it is the exact same. And Ooh, geese up there. Oh, and that just de-rendered. <laughs> I guess that happens. Now, I have no clue where the other one went, to be honest. No freaking clue at all. I guess we won't be able to pick that up. Um, I was just curious if the zones are there where it was reset. If it's going to get reset, I need to check my map more. I would check your map, man, because apparently all of them are getting the reset except for SRP. I'm going to really check on my phone if I see anything there. Because I thought I saw something about this, but... Oh, I'm not 100% sure now. I might have misread something. But I was very, very sure that it's all of the maps except for SRP. Um... Yeah, I'm a little bit unsure about it now, to be fair. Um, Dustin happens for real one day and hey, you won't look because he thinks it's a prank. Bit like the boy who cried. We'll, uh, we'll see. I'll see. We shall see. I don't think it's going to happen, but it might, you know. It might happen. It might not. Uh, service is killing me. Okay, turtle boy. Sorry for sending that message so late. If you're still here, thank you for stopping by. And I hope to catch you soon again on another stream. But yeah, this is one of the white tail lakes as well. There's two zones here that I have. Obviously, it's not white tail drink time anymore. But we could check for moose real quick. But we have a zone right down there. Let me really get to the edge. Um, 
Yeah, right there. We have one zone right on over there. Got another zone right on. Oh, look. There's even some white till there. Still staggering around. We've got those guys there. We've got a group of them back there. But obviously, they are no longer here. You know what? Let's check one of these, these bottom areas. We haven't really gone here at all. Um... Or no, just go to Ugan. I think we'll go on... I know definitely Tevaro I got to reset because I've seen the new zone locations. Uh, that is one of the things I checked. Oh, wait, there's a tent here. Oh, by the way, yeah, this is one of the coolest things. Look. A custom called Wild Basketball. As a former basketball player, I truly love this. I am... Um, I want to play with that. I wish we could pick that basketball up and have like a, a mini game here. And actually play basketball here. I feel like that'd be really cool. Ooh, ooh. bird, bird, bird. Ah, uh, that's a raccoon dog. We're going to have to go look at some raccoon dogs soon as well. They look pretty cool. They do look very, very cool indeed. Oh, look, we already have something flying above us. Oh, there's the golden eye. Oh, they go up to a thousand scoring already on the male, on the female level one. Hello. Damn. That is large scoring. I think we might have to do a setup right here. We might do that in a second. We might try and see if we can get, you know. Actually, no, let's check it out now. Let's look if we have uh, golden eye decoys. We might as well set some down here and see if that works. Let's try it out. Why not? Why not try it out? While I look for some moose around here. Because I'm pretty sure we'll have some somewhere here. Um, you got a 1000 score on day one. There was a female that just looked, uh, that just had an estimate that went up to, what was it, a thousand? And then we had males that went up to 1024. There were some, some big ones there. All right, let's look. We have mallard, grape. Let's look in the store. I haven't actually checked. Lures, decoys, Canadian geese, yeah, Eurasian teal, so we're going to have to buy those at some point. Golden eye. Um, traction strength, uh, max of 20 decoys. So if we buy two of these, we would have enough. Oh. Huh. Tough to duck decoy. Oh, that's a raccoon die, okay. Should we spend some on them? You know what? Why not? We're going to need them anyway at some point, right? Where are these guys at? We've got 10 of them. All right, let's do that. Let's do that. And then we might as well try out the new... The new blind here. And then let's take the... Golden eye decoys with us. Perfect. And then, oh wait, do we have the collar for them? Something I should maybe try and do. Um. Um. Let's look. Is there another collar that we have to buy as well? I thought we had all of them. Let's look. Which one calls them in? I'm just going to go through all of them, to be fair. It's all the turkeys. Can we not call them in, then? Mallard, cinnamon, duck, two. Hmm. Right, okay, I guess we'll just try it like this, then. I guess we will just try like this. B-Boy, welcome, welcome. How are you? Good to see you here. All right, where do we want to try this out? I where are they at? Where are they at? Where are they at? Oh, there they are. 
Ooh, there's even Grey Leg Goose here. Okay. That's actually quite a good one as well. With an estimate of three. Alright, this right here might be a good spot, you know. Let's, um... Put the Incognito Blind in somewhere here. Oops. I want to know how far out I can place this thing. Oh, so it does have to be somewhat close to shore. Okay, I thought we could like go in the middle of the lake. But you know what? Let's put that here. Let's enter it. And then let's uh, get out some of our, our lures. Come on. Let's go. Ben, welcome back. Okay, to be fair, I think we should maybe try and go out a little bit. So that we don't have them all so close. What was that? Damn. Alright, those things... Can get quite... Look at that. Kind of a mix and match around here. No clue if there's any better way or worse way of doing this, but we're just gonna We're just gonna spread these guys out a little bit. And then let's go sit in here. Let's just uh let's just hit out hit out some calls, you know. Let's see what we can get. Oh look at that. There's already breaking going on up there. Do I have the catchatory? No, I do not yet. I need like a 1,500 shotgun score for that, which I currently just do not have. What is that? Oh, that's a golden eye. Look at them. They're, they're already coming in hot. And I'm curious what their diamond score is. Because they go up to like a 1,000, some of these level 1s already. There is a lot going on here. We definitely need a better shotgun. Let me tell you that much. There's more stuff coming in up there as well. Hello. I think we might do a little shotgun setup here in a second. Okay, I can't spot that high up, but there's Grey Goose. Oh, snap. They're already coming in hot. Oh, snap. Uh-oh. I haven't even shot one of these yet. Oh, no. All right. Let me tell you that much. That was a, an epic fail right there on my end. Okay, we're reloaded already. Alright, there's... More stuff back there. Let's, let's set out some calls. Let's go. You don't watch out, they may take care of it. I've noticed that. They're, they're coming in real close. Like, they come in real, real close here. Oh, there's some coming up there. What's that? What's that? What's that? Oh, those are some of those uh, fake geese, as I like to call them, that we've already had on Hirschfelden's. Yeah. I do not want to dismantle them. Okay, I gotta place these further away, otherwise dismantling seems to be the thing that happens quite a bit here. Okay, there's some grey leg geese there, they don't want to come in. Ooh, level four there. That's not shabby. Oh yeah, golden eye coming in again. That is what I like to see. Alright, let's look what we have. A level one. How are they defensive? Alright, I think that's because we have some of these just way too close. I 
think I gotta place them a little bit further away just so I don't accidentally dismantle these bad guys. So let's do that. And then let's see if I can dismantle anyway any of them from here. No, okay, cool. That's awesome. Let's get calling. What is a darker goose? That was level three. I think that was a, a gray light goose. All right, cool look. Golden eyes coming in again. Coming in hot. Ooh, that one in the front looks different. All right, that's a male. Doesn't go up to a thousand. Look, that female. Do the females score higher here? Because it appears to me like they score higher. Ooh, let's stay laying down. Let's just let them do their circles. Kind of track them around. And then let's see if we can get some good shots on them. Uh, look at them right there. Oh, oh that was terrible. Oh, no. I think we got one of them. Alright, let's look. Did I get one of them? I have no clue where the f I was aiming that time. Alright, let's stay... A little bit calmer here. They are really fast. Like, those things are freaking fast. Oh, look, that's a Canada goose there again. A level 3 that scores that high, damn. A 6 to 8 on that one. That's a big one. I wonder if they changed something about how the geese or the animals in general score, because I feel like they did. No, no, I, I'm not ignoring the level 3s. I've just noticed there's a lot of level 3s of certain animals. Like, a, a lot of them. I think we might have spooked everything. But, not to worry. These guys come in like it's nothing. So, you know. Let's look. Ooh, golden eyes coming in again. Let's look. What does that... Oh, that, that tool is going big. That tool score is big. Oh, there's so more coming in. Damn. What's that? What's that? What's that? It's a level one. I, I really want to get that one level two. Oh, where is it at? There, that one. That's the one I want to get. Alright, let's track him. Because that's the one I really want to try and shoot. He looks like he's big scoring. Oh, I see all of them landing here. Alright, he's coming in. Oh, where the frick are they at? Alright, we hit something. Come on, reload. Oh, buddy. Oh, these guys are hard to freaking shoot. In comparison to the geese. Oh, this is a challenge. This is a challenge. They need 1,200 to be diamond, but oh, look at that. These things look sick. Hello. Whoa. They have quite the size difference. But yeah, let's... Oh, and they pay well as well. Hello. I know what we're doing for cash. We're going to be hunting some gold now in a second. Let me get a, let me get a quick setup for them going. Let's... Uh, oh, confirm trophy. Did I shoot another one? Did we get a three in one? Hello, we got a three in one. Yes, sir. We got ourselves a three in one. That was, they are tough to hit, let me tell you. They are not easy. So what's the multi-mounts? We'll go through the multi-mounts in just a second. They've added, I think, four or three new ones. Um, but we'll go through those in just a quick minute. Um, 
Man, that is a lot of fun. I am excited right now. Damn. It's been a long time since I've been this excited about freaking hunting ducks. Alright, let's look. What shotguns can I buy? Do I have any, any money for anything? Ah, uh, we can try the middle. These all are just two shot, I believe. Oh, wait, what about this one? The Norden. Let's try this one out. What are the compatible shots? 20 gauge, bird shot. Okay, let's buy. What's this? What's the difference between the two? Uh... What's the difference between them? I have no clue if there's any difference between them. There might be. There might not be. But yeah, let's let's get the shotgun loaded up. I want to know. Let's let's get let's let's take some shotguns with us. Let's take that with us. I can't take another shotgun. You know what? I feel like without my, this amount of shot. Oh wait, I need the the twenty gauge bird shot as well. There we go. Let's let's test this out. Let's move the M1 out of the way. Let's move the Zarzar out of the way. Let's take that one there. The Norden. How many shots does this have? I'm I'm curious. Oh, I just need to buy some more of the other ammo as well. I just realized. Shotgun ammo. We're gonna need 12 gauge bird shot. Let's just buy a bunch of that. 410 bird shot. What's this for? Oh, that's the my little. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna be using that. That's a. Uh, that's the forbidden. Uh, let's let's buy a couple more of these. We're gonna be making cash in a second. Got enough shots on those two. All right, which one's this? All right, so this comes with three. All right, how much do we need for the uh, catchatory? Uh, I used. Let's look. Um, yeah, see, I need. Oh, we're almost there. Okay. We need it. We need the cash for it. But once we have the cash, we can buy that. That's gonna make our life so much easier. Three shots. Uh, six shots. I mean. Get me signed up now. Cade. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Norton is what I used a lot. It's like the Cacciatore, but only three shots. I love the Cacciatore. That's like my go-to freaking uh, go freaking shotgun. So let's see how this goes. It's going good, Cade. It is going good so far. No diamonds yet, but, you know, we're exploring the map. We found an awesome spot for golden eyes. And, yeah, let's look if we can get lucky here and find something good in just a minute. I don't know if I'll stick with this blind. I like it, but I would uh, prefer the better being able to look up. That's uh, one of the things that's a little bit of a pain right now, but we can get by for the moment. My right, let's look. Cannot find a Puma on Classic. Damn, Jamie, sorry. I just saw that message now, but... I wish you the best of luck. I hope you can find one. And yeah, if you guys will be so kind as to like the stream, that would be very, very nice. Um, or, yeah, I think I think there's gonna be a good option for now. What we'll do is we'll we'll pull out pull out the Nord and we go pom pom pom, and then we'll we'll switch over and go pop pop, and shoot some more that way. I think that's I think that's gonna be a very good option right there as well. I think that's gonna be gonna be effective. All right, where them golden eyes at? Come on now. I'm just sitting some calls in case they're somewhere behind there. And I know this is for the what is this? The bean goose, the bean goose collar is what we're using right now. Um, Cooper, welcome in as well. Okay, which geese was coming around here? Fabizi, welcome. How are you, man? Good to see you in here. Found any Ration Teal or Golden Eye yet? B 
Beezy, we're right here at... This is an amazing spot for Goldeneye. Um, it is right at... Um, Huncast and Tallow. I haven't found Eurasian Teal yet. But I'd imagine they're probably somewhere down here. Uh, I saw somebody talking about it on a live stream earlier. But I was... Uh, on a bike, so I was just listening. But they said that somewhere in the southern area they had seen it. But I'm 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 looking for them. I am definitely looking for them. And I've also found that bean geese. I forget which geese it is, but one of the geese species, grey goose are here and one other one. Uh do come around here. I don't have a setup, but I found that you can call them in by just uh, using the collar. I've done that quite a bit up in this area here. Um, while I was running around, I kept seeing geese fly in, and I just took out the collar, laid down on the ground, and they just decided to come in. Now, obviously, when I try and want to show this off, uh, they don't want to come in again. Uh, bottom middle is somewhere I haven't tried yet, but I found tufted on the bottom right, so I'll have to try at the middle and left. The left seems to be good for Goldeneye. I saw some yesterday, or heard some yesterday when I was running around but I haven't been anywhere here yet I I haven't seen the, them as well I really want to try it out though I really really do but I, I saw the golden eyes I was actually going here to look for moose and then we were just swarmed by like 20 or 30 golden eye flying above us and I was like all right I'm putting a set up here and we've had good luck until now I guess this is the show off effect you know if you want to try and show What's around here? Oh, look, right there. That is where the golden eyes are. And then what's this other thing coming in? Oh, look, there we go. Canada geese up there as well. These guys are coming in quick. I found it hard getting good shots at them, I'll be honest. Like, I even wait for them to come down, and they are just... Zoom! Like, they go crazy. They go really, really quickly. Let me try and spot some of them. But even then, even if I spot them, I find it hard to actually shoot the one that I want to shoot. Like, I keep just hitting a different one. I, I, I keep hitting the wrong ones, I'm going to be honest. Ooh, look, more coming in. These are going to be easy to spot. Let's look. One, one, okay. Let's just shoot the other ones. Um... Alright, Kate, we've talked about this in the past, man. Where is it? Nope, not busy. I don't want to put busy there. Break it now. Give me one second. There we go. Oh, wait, not not busy up. My bad, busy. Wrong one. Wrong one. Uh. I got the wrong one. Meant it somebody else. Sorry there. Uh, freaking hell, why is YouTube taking so long to load today? There we go. This should be it. BZ, my bad on that one. I did not mean to hide you. That was uh, meant for somebody else. Now, where are these ducks? Oh, look at that. We're getting a picture of that. I haven't managed to do that all game yet. That is... Can we get... Oh, we're trying something. We're trying something. Let's see if we can get them all in one shot. Well, not all of them, but a good amount of them. I think we had something. But yeah, these guys are fast. Look at how quickly they ran away. That's crazy. Um... BZ, yeah, uh, they definitely increased the speed at which the birds fly. It is insane. It is insane how quickly these guys are now. Is that guy just casually chilling there? <laughs> you know what? We'll take him out with the 223. I mean, if he or she just... Whoops. Oh, let's maybe use... You know what? Let's just use this. If they just want to chill right there. Oh, whoops. Gold mine, another one, 950. Oh, gray. Guess that means they have a different head color. 
Because I feel like the other ones had a black head, no? That looks awesome. That looks really, really cool. Alright, why are we so shaky in this thing? And why is that one just casually there? Now, let's aim a little bit higher. Oops. Oh, no. That might get them all away. This is definitely going to be a learning curve to learn how to do this. Uh, does BZ have early access? Yes, he does. He does have early access. If you don't know who he is, he is an awesome... He doesn't just do Call of the Wild. He does um, some fishing as well. Some fishing games. I don't remember if you play Classic BZ, but I know you definitely do um, Ultimate Fishing, wasn't it? Then you knew planet fishing, and then I believe I saw you doing um, the uh, what's it called? I love that. Oh, world sim pro fishing world pro sim, whatever it's called. That game. I've seen you play that before. It's a lot of fun to do. Did I get one? Yes, I got one there. I saw one flying down to the ground. Yeah, we definitely got one there. Kind of need them to die in the water, otherwise I know for a fact I'm not going to find them. <laughs> I suck at absolutely finding where I shot the the ducks and geese. I always, I always prefer when they land in here. Um, um, <laughs> didn't notice anything. Okay, that's good at least to know. That is at least good to know. Because on my end, it says that those messages got removed. So I can still see them. But for anybody else that wants to see it, um, you can't. But I'll definitely take that dart, knowing that they're in the bottom right hand of the corner. One thing you should check out, Bees, if you want to look at some white tail deer. This lake right here. Fantastic. Where's the other one that I found? Oh, there's one other lake. This one right here. Absolutely loaded with white tilt here. Um, and this area right here is just incredible. Like, it was incredible with the amount that was there. It was absolutely awesome. Like, it was really, really, really good. I think there's, like, on my map, I think I have, like, 40-ish or so there. All right, let's, let's shoot that one there, because that one doesn't seem to be... Wanting to go away. Alright, there we go. If it doesn't want to move away, we might as well shoot it, right? Might as well take it out. Well, let's let's look. What did we get? Got a female. Again. I mean, these guys just look amazing. Like, look at that. I love the whole new contrasting that they have going on as well. It is just... They have done an amazing job with that for sure. Like, they have done such a good job with this. Like, the way that the harvest screen looks. The only thing that I wish they did now, and I'll show that in just a second here, uh, when we pick this thing up, is, like, if they did this one change, I don't think as a content creator I'd have anything to say about this at all. Alright, okay. A male black. Ooh. That looks cool with the kind of, like, teal glow as you turn around but if they took away this border that comes up here i feel like this would be fantastic like i feel like that would be 10 out of 10 harvest screens amazing for taking pictures of like white-tailed deer red deer and just some of the bigger animals that don't quite fit in uh down here in the bottom like in the full screen i feel like that would improve things for at least us content creators and for people who like to share screenshots such a big upside like, such a, such a big upside. But yeah, let's, uh, let's go away from these guys for a little bit. I want to kind of do a little bit of walking down in this direction and see if we can hear anything in the sky there. Uh, yeah, the landing can, can be difficult to deal with. I've noticed that some of them seem to land into the wind and others land with the wind. So it might be worth getting up a few different spots for wind adjust. Ooh, that might be a good idea. I haven't thought about that, to be fair. Um, I've kind of just been going with it for now, at least. 
Um, all right, I'm going to go have a good stream. Okay, Alaskan, thank you for stopping by. I hope I'll catch you soon. Have a good one. Um, but sweet, I'll have to check those spots out. I haven't gone north um, of the starting area. Oh, I would. There's so many... Um, what are they called? There's Capricales all up in this area here. Like, up in this area. And then there's... What are they called again? The Farmigan, is that what it's called? The Hazel Grouse are there. The other grouse species is also there. And then your yeah, Rock Farmigans are all around that area as well. It is incredible. Like, wherever you go, you get some kind of call. It really gives me... Um, what's it called? It really gives me SRP vibes with how many animals I can find here in between. It may just be birds, but it's still incredible. Like, really, really good. Um, except mods. Um, we can view deleted messages. Haven't figured out how to use out the use of being able to see them, but I'll figure it out one day. I don't think you can see them. I feel like if I delete them on YouTube, I don't think even the mods can see them anymore. Um, but I can see messages that a mod deletes. Uh, I know that much because we've had that happen in the past. Luckily, not a lot, but it does sadly happen occasionally. Ooh. I swear, whenever I see a moose now, they seem to look always bigger. That's, that's one thing I've noticed. I feel like the moose look, look bigger. Oh, Willow Farmigan. I don't think I've seen those guys yet. Ooh, and they're flying away. Ooh, we've got a level 2 there, though. Might be good for the future. Um. Oh, yeah, the animals look awesome. They definitely do. They definitely, definitely do. I feel like it's going to be amazing to see what some of the other animals will look like as well here in the future. Like... I want to really see what Red Deer looks like. I feel like Red Deer might be freaking awesome. Like, I think they could have really, really big potential. But yeah, let's have a look what a moose looks like um, in the new harvest screen. I haven't shot one of them yet. All right, there we go. That should do it for them. Bottom boy, how are you doing? Good to see you here. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, I just disconnected my headphones. Plug those back in real quick. Um, Jamie, still no Puma? Oh, man, that sucks. I wish I could give you better tips, but I've... I think I've only ever shot, I think, one or two Pumas in Classic. So I have got zilch clues on where they at. I've literally just stumbled across them in the top middle of the map. <laughs> Maybe your PC server save, yeah. Coming at him straight like that. Coming straight for him like that. I see how it is doing. How are you liking the new... Oh, bottom boy, I cannot even put it into words. Uh, if you can hear it on my voice, I've already lost my voice a little bit. With all the, oh, wow, that I've been saying. Like, I've been, I've been getting so excited. Like, my voice is, is slowly starting to fade. I've noticed that. My... I've been doing so much talk and getting so excited about all of this. It's, it's fading my voice right now. I can feel my... Um, what's it called? My voice cords, my vocal cords to, uh, to burn and itch a little bit from talking so much. And being a little bit more energetic than usual. I mean, not more energetic, but just... I guess we're just being a little bit more vocal here and there. Because of how excited I've gotten, but... Oh my... Look at that! Look at that! That's insane! That looks so good! That looks incredible! That is just insane! Hello, new thumbnail pictures right there! Wow. That looks so good. That looks really, really good. 
Like, really good. I am over the moon right now. That is insane. That is freaking gorgeous. Wow. That's awesome, man. I just got out of Flinder Stream. I was super impressed with everything. Yeah, I am so, so impressed by it. Haven't been this pumped since SRP, honestly. Honestly, I was... I don't think I was either. I was really pumped about um, Rancho when it came out. And I still love the map. But this in comparison... Ooh, I haven't shown you guys these things yet. Uh, but in comparison... Just this just... I had something in such a different way that I don't know. Like, white hunting on here is going to be freaking insane. And I wasn't here for SRP, so I couldn't quite talk about how excited I was about that just because I didn't quite, I wasn't quite in it in the hype as much because I was obviously at college at the time. But now I, I am so hyped here. Like, this new duck hunting, it just adds such a good flair to the game. It really does. Like, it just adds such a good flair to it. Ooh, look, more raccoon dogs. Ooh, another level three. Uh, I know I've shown one in the video, but I know not everybody saw it. So why don't we go ahead and take a look at these here? Ooh, a male. I actually don't think I've seen a male yet. That's another female. Come on, there's got to be a male here somewhere. All right, we might have a look in a second. Let's pick up this one here first so that I can show it to you guys. There we go. Oh, there's one. Oh, that's a lynx. <laughs> that is a lynx running there. We already saw those earlier. I mean, these things just look incredible, don't they? I'll let this run for a second. Just, just have a look at them. They just look freaking gorgeous. And they go up to level 9 as far as I know. But yeah, very, very, very cool. Like, that is... Oh, freaking love the way they look. I'm definitely going to try and get myself a diamond for those very quickly at the beginning. I think that's going to be one of the top number one animals for sure. Now, I'm curious. I think we can get on these small islands here because I think this question mark there means that we can potentially fast travel across the water there um that's what i said earlier they're gonna have to either do another africa map to complete compete with this one because it's the best up map update since srp yeah i mean they're gonna have to do something great to top this like i'll be honest like this has added so much hype plus all the other reworks like especially for console this right here Per console is gonna be a game changer and I mean a game changer cuz it's gonna make it so much easier like coming from being a console player myself I remember how painful it sometimes was remembering where everything was having to press the d-pad up and then scrolling across to your gun and then if you didn't know what your gun looked like you'd occasionally shoot stuff with the wrong gun and then it mess up your score or blah 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 but now with the weapon wheel, that's not going to happen. I mean, you can literally see what ammo you have in there, what class it goes up to. Like, if you look here, it tells me everything. Recommended classes. Let me go to one. Oh, I don't have anything in there. But here, look. It tells me classes 2, 3, and 4. Penetration, expansion, effective range, magazine size, reload speed. All of that, it tells me right there. And that is just incredible to have. That is such a powerful tool that I think we all are going to really enjoy. Oh, willow farm again again. I know I'm a little bit all over the place here right now, but... Man, there's just so much to explore here. I haven't even seen all of the species yet. Like, that's kind of crazy to think how much time I've already spent on this map. And I still have not seen everything. I haven't even shot one of these... Um, rabbits, to be fair. I've seen them off in the distance, but I haven't shot one. And oh, look, a level six. You know what? Let's do that. Where is he? There he is. 
Oh, this 223 is freaking amazing against these guys. I think this is going to be the gun I'll carry for them. Like, it is taking them out like it's nothing. Oh, there's a 5 as well there. Very nice. Very, 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 very nice. All right, let's pick this guy up. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. A black and white one this time. Very, very, very cool. Ooh, and a level up. Even better. Um, Should have made raccoon dogs to five. I know they're predators, but so are raccoons. Um, I don't know. I'm not going to complain about it, to be fair. Um, Might make it just a little bit more reviability there in terms of the scoring and the level but of course i mean they don't really have any changes in terms of the body so it doesn't really matter if you get a level nine or a level one in your lodge technically uh, except for the score but obviously getting that feeling of a diamond um definitely is something unique for sure now i wonder is there going to be any animals <laughs> uh on that island over there or is that just gonna be for birds i'm curious i am very very curious even though yeah it's oh wait this doesn't even bring you to the island so i guess you can't go on this island interesting okay i mean that's good to know what's flying above us what's flying above us um oh way up there Canadian goose. Nice. I wish I could call them in right now, but I don't have the Canada geese call around me. My map's favorite, it's to least favorite. Medved, Rivantuli Coast, Leighton, Yukon, Parquet, Quattro, um, Verhanga, SRP, Tevaroa, Mississippi, Hirsch. Interesting list. I know that uh, obviously Medved is your, your number one. Your your favorite map of the ball like that is just a fact i think that that we all know what do we have up there what do we have up there Ooh, the mallards are here okay so this is where these guys are probably going to be best to hunt at somewhere in this area i kind of want to get over there to that island i believe that's the one i'm pretty sure i can get there by going across from there or are we going to go? I'm not sure. Wherever we land, we're definitely going to check that out. My favorites are SRP, Revon, Tuli, Verhanga. Yeah, I think this one's this one's up top right now. SRP is going to be second. And I don't know what's third right now. I think it's probably going to be Tevaroa with Red Deer now drinking from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. But we'll, we'll have a look at that in, in the future as well. Um, we definitely, definitely, definitely are going to have a look there and see that. Medved gives me headaches. I'm curious how it's going to be now after the update. Um, I'm definitely going to have to unlock Medved on this account. I haven't done that yet. Just because I was going to wait until this update drops. Since, you know. Um, then I kind of unlock all the animals with it as we go. Which is something I definitely, definitely wanted to do. I didn't want to have a map um, unlocked. Have zones there and then suddenly, you know. They all disappear a couple weeks later, so I kind of took my time with Medved, and we're going to be going there in the next coming weeks um, as we get past this release and as we get ready to take some breaks from the new map. There's a raccoon dog there. I really want to see what that is. I won't be able to spot him unless we get closer. And I don't think he's going to walk in there by himself. Alright, let's 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 look if we can see what that guy's at. I can't shoot him because I don't have anything to shoot him with. But we might as well look what we might have feeding up there, you know. Could be something good. Ooh, Canada geese back here on the ground. Are they flying away? Yes, they are. Ooh, I think we might have gotten a shot in on that one. Did we hit it? 
I don't know. I feel like I saw the, the hit animation, but I'm not too sure. And okay, that guy is just a level 3 up there. Nothing too, too crazy. But I've noticed Canada geese are kind of all around the map. I feel like I've seen them in the north, I've seen them in the south. So I don't think that finding a spot to set up for them is going to be the hardest thing in the world. I think that should be quite manageable there. Did I hear Medved is going to be hunted on stream in a few weeks? I ain't missing that. Yeah, it's coming soon. Uh, once this update drops and we've hunted this map a little bit, gotten some of the diamonds off of it, we're definitely going to go on Medved and um, do some looking around there, see what those changes did and see what we can get out of it in total because... You know, we're definitely going to need a diamond reindeer. Potentially, I think I want to try and get three again to get the um, sleigh sold separate multi-mount. Which brings me to the fact we have to go in the lodge in a second and look at those new multi-mounts. Um, has a weird reload animation. It looks like a lever action. I don't know. Let's look. Nah, that looks like a normal shotgun to be fair. Doesn't seem weird to me. That looks pretty, pretty normal. Alright, let's get that outpost right over there. That's what I love. Like, when you go to a new area, if you get within a certain range, it will just kind of show you where things are at. I just think that's really, really cool. Oh, look. I think that's another lookout tower over there. Yes, it is. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I think this might be a good spot for geese hunting as well. Because you can kind of have something standing in the middle. Like a tripod stand sitting there and then the decoys around you in the water. So that you can have them all land around you. That might be a good thing to do to be fair. Kind of wish we could see what kind of ducks fly around here. But, I mean, we might just have to wait for that. Um, better than classic? Um... I think I have to do a little bit more with it because I've noticed that the ducks individually have different speeds to them. Ooh. Eurasian teal. Okay, this is where we're going to be setting up for Eurasian teal then. Perfect. Okay. This right here is going to be the setup for Eurasian teal. This map on Nokasari. That is where we're going to go hunt them. Nice. Um, but so far, I think it might actually be better than classic to be fair. Um, we'll obviously have to wait and... Oh, my bad. We obviously will have to wait and see kind of how things develop. But overall, I think this this is probably going to be um, classic. I think it really, really is. I have a good feeling that I am going to enjoy this more or just like classic. I haven't done a lot of duck hunting in classic. I've done a lot of geese hunting. So I can't quite compare duck to duck hunting. But I can't compare the geese hunting, and I really think it is good. Like, really, really good. Um, I'm completely blank on the 12th map. What do you mean, on the 12th? Oh, um, you have Revantuli, Hirsch, Mississippi, Verhanga, Tevaroa, Rancho, Parque, Medved, Quarto, Quattro, Leighton. Um, you're missing SRP on there. Yeah, you're missing SRP on there, Ben. That is... Ooh, look at that. That's going to be a picture for a thumbnail. Whoops, let's zoom out of that again. That looks kind of cool. That looks kind of cool. Not going to lie. All right, let's look what's uh, down in this area. And then I think we're going to go in the lodge and we'll have a look at the other stuff there and see what's going on. Exactly, Dustin. He is missing SRP. Also, I just noticed the camera is facing a little bit high. There we go. That's just a little bit better. And, ooh, okay. Tough the ducks are here as well. Okay. That's awesome. I haven't seen these guys at all yet. So, Mallard's tough the ducks. Oh. I am going to be so ready to hunt them here. I think we might do that. 
Uh, I'm going to take off, but have a good rest of your stream. Okay, thank you, BZ. If you didn't see this right here, Tough the Duck, Eurasian Teal, Normal Mallards, Eurasian Widgeon. They all seem to be right here. Right, hided, uh, right hiding in plain sight right here. I feel like I'm going to do what I said. I think I might... Oh, oh, Golden Eyes is... I found the spot we're going. We're putting a freaking tripod stand right there. Putting a bunch of decoys in here. Oh boy. Oh, this is getting me excited. This is getting me excited. Very, very nice. Oh. But yeah, thank you, Busy. Thank you for stopping by. And thank you for the tip about uh, the bottom right hand of the map. Very, very good tip indeed. I will have a look at that later as well. Oh, that's right. We're, we're, we're going to set this spot up. I am telling you. We might even go over there, to be fair. I feel like that over there might be a little bit more open. Yeah, I feel like going in there, that's going to be the spot to be at. Very open. Easy to get shots at. What's that now? We have tough the ducks come. Oh, another offensive. Okay, never mind. All right, we're going to make a setup here. I feel like this is going to be the spot to do it at. I think that is going to be the spot to go to. And ooh, there's a whole village there. What is that all about? Wait, we're going there real quick. Hold up. We are going to go take a very quick trip down there. Oh, all of these spots look amazing. I feel like going in that area right there. That looks like a winner. This island in general looks amazing. Mal oh, look at all of them. Oh, I know I'm going to have to get myself a 22 on here. I don't think you can survive going on here without a 22. I don't think that is like possible at all. I just don't think it is. I really, really don't think it is. I think you're going to need those for follow-up shots. Otherwise, you're going to be missing so many trophies. Any coon dogs? Yeah, we shot, um, I think, two or three raccoon dogs like 20 minutes ago, 15 minutes ago. Something like that. Um, I'll try to talk to the Medved gods and see if I can get you some diamond reindeer lined up for you. That would be very nice. That would be very nice, Halsey. I would uh, greatly appreciate not getting trolled by him, you know? Because, uh, you know, they, they, they love to troll. Oh, look, they're landing on their own. All right, we might take that to our advantage. We will definitely take that to our advantage. Because uh, the more money I can save, the better it is for me. Oh, there's just so much around here. I'm, we're, we're getting back at this tomorrow, guys. We are going to be back hunting more of these ducks, more of these waterfowls, more of basically everything here because... Oh, there's just so much to do. So, so much to do. And I know now why... Why TK and them uh, had such a hard time doing it all in like a couple streams. There is just so much to freaking explore here. And is that the Lokat Tower from Tevroa? That's kind of what it looks like, to be fair. Dang, dismissed them was making lunch fork if you watch the video from today you'll find them in there as well uh i did shoot i believe one or two of them there so you can have a look uh and see them there just don't shoot the nenets reindeer or they'll be angry oh yeah i know i know they'll be very very angry with me i'll make sure to uh leave them alone to uh, let them be for them but yeah let's quickly figure out where this lodge is pick that up and then then we'll head to the lodge, as promised. And I feel my voice going away. This is crazy. That is a very rare occurrence that my voice goes. I don't think I've lost my voice in like over two years. With playing basketball, screaming across the courts for like an hour, hour and a half, or even two hours. Doing a two hour stream. <laughs> it gets you. It takes your water, like your freaking voice away. Um, can you try duck and parquet? Yeah, we will try ducks and parquet soon. 
Um, today, though, we're just going to be staying on here just because I want to show off um, what the new map looks like. But we will do that soon. And welcome to the stream as well to you. All right, let's look. Is there anything drinking at this time anyway? I don't even know. There might be, but I'm not sure. By the way, can we cross in the middle there? No, we cannot. This is, some, this is something that we're gonna have to get used to not seeing anymore. Just having random ducks just kind of laying in the water everywhere. That's gonna be a, a big adjustment that we're all gonna have to do, I think. Like not having them just, you know, lay around here all the time. It's, it's gonna be something new, gonna be something different. <laughs> I have timber gold hate. Aw, oh, Jamie, poor you. Poor you. Trying to find yourself that puma. No good. No good at all. I'm curious to brown bear drink at this time. So many questions. So many freaking questions. Alright, let's just walk around. I want to show you guys the quick multi mounts as well. Before we finish off here. Um, Canada geese land on water now on he Hirsch. I don't know. I think they're still going to be landing mainly on land on Hirsch. Unless you have like a setup in the water. Which I feel like that'd be kind of hard to do in Hirsch. Like they'll still land in the fields. Like you could still hunt them in the fields as well. There's not fields like in Hirsch. But there's open areas all up around here. That you can um, definitely go explore and um, hunt them there. Actually, you know what? Let's take a quick... Wait, do I still have the tent on me? Oh, wait. I don't even have a tent on me. Okay, never mind. I was going to say let's take a tent and then drive over there with an ATV. But obviously, I can't take an ATV with me if I don't have a freaking tent up. But there doesn't seem to be anything drinking here anyways. Let's just run around. Let's just run around like that. And then if you guys have any questions, I'll be more than happy to answer them now. Um, assuming I can. Of course. Because if you have any. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, what's that? Wait, that's no ducks. Where are the ducks at? I hear you. Oh, a willow farm again. Oh, that's what they were. I thought we had a new duck species flying. And I was like, oh, wait, wait, wait up. Where are they at? Um, I want to hunt them waterless trees, I think. Um, I'm pretty sure you'll be able to hunt them in the water as well. Um, I haven't called in the geese in the water yet. We can look, though. Where is um, wildlife? Can not Canada goose. Um, habitat. Grassy fields, pastures, and agricultural fields. Um, from dawn to early evening. To um, the V-shaped formation signal changed. I guess we'll see. Um, I, I, I mean, we'll do more testing here as well. We'll try and call in more animals. As we unlock more of the map and have more of the geese setups going to see if that works there. Uh, I want the mic the ducks land in water and on land. Yeah, th they do that. I, I know that they definitely land on land. Uh, I'm just not sure about the water. I'm pretty sure they will though. I am pretty, pretty sure. Ooh, what do we have up there? What do we have up there? I just got a call. Moose. All right, what are you guys? Gray like, ooh, I haven't had the chance to call these guys in yet either. I think I can hit one of them with a shotgun. Nope. I guess not. I guess not. Oh, okay, we're gonna, you know what? This spot looks good for Gray like Goose, to be fair. Right, let me skip the sign as well, real quick. Alright, we'll remember that 
Grey like goose are here. In this area. Oh, that is awesome. That is freaking awesome. I would stream longer, to be fair today. Uh, I definitely would. I'm having a lot of fun right now. But I haven't eaten dinner yet. And it is uh, currently 10.03. Um, and I haven't eaten in like... Roughly 8, 9 hours. Something like that. So... Yeah, I kind of really got to try and eat something. But... We'll get back at this tomorrow. Um, during the day, I'll probably try and make a video. And then... We'll see how it goes, but we should be back tomorrow in the evening in the usual times as well and doing more streaming and we're going to quickly finish off by going in the lodge having a look at what the new trophy poses look like. Let's look. Let's have a look here. Now let me just quickly check that we didn't get anything... On there. Um, did we get... Um, no, that's just the regular community update, I believe. Um, let's look. Alright, let me show you guys these things. Um, trophy mounts. So the first one is this one. Foul play. Raccoon dog with a wild... Uh, with a willow farm again. Then we have... I gotta go through these again. Um, play fighting, no. Fox's lunch, no. There's another one somewhere here. Where is it? I, I guess we're gonna go through them just like this. Um, oh, there we go. The two black bears fighting. That is a new one. Um, then... Wait, is this one new? No, I think that one's already been there. That one's been there. Bunny Squad, oh, that's an old one. There we go, this is a new one. Foul Feud. Two Black Rouse fighting right there. Um, That one's been there, that one's been there. Western Capricali, Smooth Operator. That is a new one there as well. And yeah, that is all the new ones right there. That is all the new multi-mounts all right there. But that is going to be it for me today. We are going to be back again tomorrow. If you have any ideas on what we want to do in stream, make sure to put them in the Discord so that we so I can have a look at that and kind of see what you guys want to see more or not. Um, so definitely let me know on there. Thank you for stopping by. I will catch you guys soon. Have a good one. Bye-bye. And peace.